Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl TJ and as you guys can see, we are here with Summer Hair and y'all know Summer is right around the corner and y'all know what that means. It's bulb season, okay? But this is just not any bulb. This is a glueless bulb, okay? So, <laughs> so let me stop playing y'all. But anyway, y'all, this is 150% in density. She's 14 inches and I believe the lace is a 6 by 4.75. Um, look at the hairline, y'all. They came in a clutch with their hairline. They plucked that to the gods impeccable um i'm not gonna be bleaching it plucking doing anything of that nature because y'all see it's not necessary so let's get into it first we're gonna go ahead and tint the lace i'm using red by kisses lace tint and spray y'all know I, I rave about this stuff i'm obsessed okay i'm in the shade medium dark brown but i'm gonna go ahead and just make sure this whole entire section here is melted i mean tinted you can use concealer you can use foundation whatever you have i would recommend you going a shade or two down so it can blend in with your skin seamlessly I be thinking I be pressing record, but I don't, so I don't have the footage of me putting the wig on my head, but this is what it looks like after it's on. I'm taking a powder puff and I sprayed it with a little bit more of that tinting spray and just spraying it or patting it on top of the lace so it can blend in more seamlessly. I'm going in with my Erica J Wax Stick. I'm just placing this all over the top of the unit. I'm going to go on to the lace portion as well. I try not to put too much because you don't want the wig to look way down and greasy. But you do want enough so the hair can look super duper laid. And you know, it, it just gives it a vibe. Wax changes the game, okay? Y'all see how that looks? Now, I just got to give it to a somber hair. Y'all deserve a round of applause because that lace is giving what it's supposed to give. Like, I did not bleach those knots and you can't even see them, okay? The only thing I did was tint it. I'm going in now with my Eben Wonder Lace Adhesive Spray. I just sprayed a little bit on this edge brush and I'm just brushing it onto the hair strands. As you guys can see, I'm just, you know, following the direction that I um, hot comb the hair. And this is just so the hair strands stay in place. It's not melting the lace, as you guys can see. It's just making sure my hair strands ain't going to wear. We're going in with our Ruby Kisses Foundation. And this is in the shade level 15. Y'all, I don't like the pop of the part anymore. I like my part to look a little bit natural. So I do go two shades down um, as well in this. And look at that. It looks good. It looks so good. <laughs> Now I'm just running my flat iron through this. This is the Babyliss Pro. I'm obsessed with this flat iron, y'all. But y'all, this hair was super soft and silky straight out of the package. But I'm just going in to just give the hair a little oomph, rebumping the ends. So this is the back of the hair. As you guys can see, it's giving body, 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 okay? <laughs> it's giving body. Everything is nice and cut evenly. I love it, but I'm just gonna go in, me personally, and just trim up the front. Um, the front seems to be a little bit longer to me, and I just love like a blunt bob cut. So I did trim it up in the front to, to make it, you know, nice and cohesive. So 
so this is what it looks like once i do a little trimming it looks super good i love it okay i love it and i'm just gonna do a little shaking of the head just to see if my wig will fly off and girl we good she ain't coming off she ain't going nowhere so now i'm just gonna go in and do some baby hairs i don't I think I've done any baby hairs on any glueless wigs that I had thus far. So we're gonna do some baby hairs today. I'm just gonna part a little section on both sides, making sure they're even. And then we're gonna go in and we're just gonna cut that off. Like I said, if you're a beginner with baby hairs, cut longer and trim as needed. To lay my edges, I'm going in with the lace putty, y'all. When I tell you I have not put this product down, this is my favorite product to do my baby hairs with. And I'm, I'm completely obsessed, okay? It, it just it just makes the process super duper easy. Now, if you are new when it comes to baby hairs as well, use a one inch flat arm to curl your baby hairs first. And using your flat arm will also help your baby hair swoop very easily. And then I'm just gonna follow up with a little bit of heat. So this is what we looking like right now, okay? We're gonna take these down and y'all know I love to have a little oomph on the top of my wigs. I got to have that little bump. So I'm just gonna take the back of my flat iron since it gets hot as well. And we just gonna bump that up there. I did spray a little bit of hairspray. I must wasn't recording, uh, but I sprayed some Sebastian hairspray to help that stay in place as well. And this is what it looks like. Y'all see how blunt that looks? I, I'm obsessed, okay? This is giving what it's supposed to give. Y'all can't tell me nothing, okay? Straight out the box. Decided to add some curls. I'm like, okay, she's giving what she's supposed to give. But what would she give with some curls? And y'all, I fell in love, okay? I fell in love. Now, I didn't think I was going to curl it. That's why I started in the front. Normally, I would section it off and do it nice and cohesive. Honestly, I was running out of time as well. I had to go somewhere, so... We had to hurry this thing along, but um, y'all, I enjoyed working with this wig. This wig is a 10 out of mother freaking 10 in my book. Summer did that, okay? They did that. This is an install fresh out of the box. I didn't wash it. I didn't condition it. I didn't do anything. No plucking, no bleaching of the knots, and it was super duper easy. Like I said, I love glueless wigs simply because... At nighttime, I don't know about you, but I'm trying to just come home and snatch this off and put my bonnet on and go about my business. I don't like to be sleeping up in no wigs. I just don't. I can't, okay? So glueless wigs are for my girlies who don't like using lace spray, glues who want to snatch their wigs off at night. <laughs> So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Let me know. Oh, by the way, y'all, this wig is like a hundred something dollars. It's under $150. So that's also a, a plus in my book. So I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And until my next video, your girl will see you later. Bye guys. For a left hand with a gym over a piece of me My mind's always as clear when she done climbing on the top of me Really by the code needs you to keep the same